you know? Sometimes, like, even in the upbeat will kill. It means, yeah. like, bear, 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 upbeat. Yeah. And, you know, sometimes, like, certain characters will just die to that. Falco and with his super high double jump and, you know, side B and up B probably won't, but it'll still put him in a really bad position where if he can get the ledge first, it's just game over at that point, I would say. Yeah. We have a lot of great tags in this setup. Right. Oh, right. okay. I was looking for his uh, name there. All right. Um, all right, I'm excited. This is going to be, a, yeah. I think this is going to be a very competitive and fun to watch match. Oh, yeah. Here we go, game one. Now I'm excited to see how Nexus is going to adapt to No Monty's oppression, especially with the Nair. Interesting, uh, going to Battlefield game one here. Right. Not sure who has the edge on the stage, but uh, interesting choice. We usually see Stadium. Right. Oh, and you saw him going for that up tilt, and just like we said earlier, you know, it's going to get beaten out by the up B. Oh yeah, you need to. It's very scary to parry those moves because they're all multi hits. Right. Uh, you need to be very aware of them. Um, either if you're going to go for that multi parry or. Oh, that's it. Oh no. Yeah, just read the get up option right there. Yeah, Monty was very confident there. Um, ledge trapping against Nexus. Good forward tilt into down tilt conversion. I haven't seen that very often. Yeah. But what oh. a follow up! Sixty seven percent on that opening. That was beautiful from yeah. Nexus. So Nexus is showing like, okay, I see you got combo, so do I. Oh, but you know what? Sometimes you only need two combos in order to kill. Yeah, down, down smash, smash forward, forward smash. smash. Exactly. And this is so scary to be uh, recovering against Game & Watch and the same Lead Trap situation yeah. covering that normal gettable down smash. And you know what? How good do you have to be at reading your opponent to consistently get that on them? Yeah, it's... Um, it covers a, a few options, but I, I want to see Nexus get up attacking that, just hitting that away. Um, I, go ahead. Yeah, I feel like his get up attack wouldn't connect, though, just because of the way that Monty spaces it. Mm, that too, yeah. yeah. It depends on how Monty's going to space it, but uh, Nexus unable to find his way back to the stage. He's just getting hit back in the air. Another uppy. He's in this juggle in the corners, exactly where you don't want to be against Game & Watch. Right. And that Ooh. hit him? That was ridiculous. Yeah. What range was that? Yeah. Oh, there we go. There's the grab. And you know what, that was another thing I hadn't really considered in the matchup was Falco's Reflector. You know, Monty can't afford to go for these forward errors, right? Because if he forwards errors at the wrong time, it's going to get reflected back, and that will be super killing him. Yeah, and oh, that's another way to get off the ledge against uh, right. the buffet. Ooh, not going to be able to anti-air the, the down air right there. Oh, buffet tried, coming yeah. up, going for the forward tilt off of it. Yeah. Oh. oh. Very good awareness. Yeah, immediate parry to down tilt. Yeah, he uh, he knew that Nexus was unable to um, to cross up there, so he went for the immediate down tilt uh, to cover that. That was extremely good from him. Right. And uh, Monty looked very, very comfortable there. Um, ledge trapping, edge guarding, and juggling. That's exactly what you should be doing against Spacey's as um, as Game & Watch. I mean, I feel like that's your game as Game & Watch versus any character. Oh, no, for sure, yeah. But even Spacey's so much more because they get comboed so much more. Their recoveries right. are much more gimpable. Much more linear, too. Exactly, exactly. Right. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Um, good po uh, good tech away from Monty getting away from that uh, drag down situation. Here we go. Dash attack. Oh, man just sneak by him with the Phantasm right there. That was weird. It, yeah. Oh, there we go. That's you know what? I wonder if it breaks the bomb before it gets reflected. I think so. I think so because it acts as a hitbox and a reflector, maybe? Yeah. Ooh, oh, wow. It's just avoiding the down smash right there by the short up fair. Nexus's side B's are a little bit antsy here. I'd like to see him uh, go for more traditional yeah. approaches, but it's working so far. He's yeah. looking uh, much more comfortable this game. Yeah. Oh, Definitely no. not falling for a lot of the openings that Monty has been going out for. Here we go. There's the grab. Down smash? Oh, Beautiful wow. two-frame for Monty. Yeah. No, I feel like Monty is so good at timing his down smashes. Yeah. You need to be with Game & Watch. That's one of your best smash attacks. Right? Yeah. Two-framing and, and ledge trapping. And, oh, not enough frames to go, to go for that uh, parry into down smash. But, yeah, Nexus is just stuck in disadvantage. Today. He's unable to get anything going. Yeah. You know, that chair is so deceptively long-lasting. Exactly. Ooh, Ooh, I'm surprised he didn't try to go for one more fair right there. Uh, he went for that side B attempt to maybe send into that spike, but um, great parry up B. Monty, he's not, he knows what he's good at, and he's just waiting for those openings, right. uh, finding those juggle nares, those up to, to up airs. And they're not going for too much more, and I like that, but fi missing that execution on that up tilt into back air. Yeah. I feel like he just wasn't spaced properly for it. He was just too high percent for it to combo. 
facing out those back airs, trying to make something happen. Forward air is going to uh, hit Monty. He needs to close his stock out here. Right. Oh, he fell oh, out of the no. up smash and he missed the up smash. Where was the up smash? The scoop hitbox miss. Oh my god. Yeah, that is just that was so, so unfortunate. unfortunate. For, yeah, yeah, Nexus had that stock. Oh, going for that uppy. Very good drift away from Nexus, not trying to get punished there. Right. Oh, that back air attempt. That could have been very, uh, that could have just killed, but right. um, he's not finding those hits he needs, and Monty's getting so much off of these, this no. extra credit. What is happening? I feel like he's just like, okay, I am not falling for that up smash. I'm going to try to poke at him with my killing down tilt. Yeah. And both times, it didn't even matter. And um, Nexus trying to mix it up with that uh, spot dodge, but even then wasn't able to. And yeah. Monty hard read that side B. He hit him with the buffet, knew I'm, you're going to side B again onto my shield, found that down smash. Right. Um, this is really rough for Nexus. Oh, gets the narrow opening. Doesn't able to combo it, but you know what? Still gets him in an edge guard situation. Oh. And this is it. That's the up B. Yeah. Go for the dare, go for the dare. Oh no, it doesn't even matter. Yeah, Nexus a little bit of a, a, a knee slap there. Um, yeah. Essentially a JV3 and that was so, so rough for him.